think it's pretty safe to say that all of us are very eager to receive some more Minecraft 1.17 news on the Caves and Cliffs update. But little did you know that that could be a lot sooner than you first expected because in this video we are going to be talking about what will be in tomorrow's 1.17 announcement. But do not worry everyone, I will explain everything in this video and everything that I think we could potentially be receiving tomorrow along with what I know for sure we will be receiving. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, be sure you drop it a like and subscribe if you are new around here. Only about 8% of you are subscribed, so be sure you change that and without wasting any more time, let's get right into the video. So this all began not with King B Dogs today, but with Japa, who is the lead artist of Minecraft, an absolute legend. And now Japa actually tweeted out saying, I have been looking into to making Grimstone a little bit lighter. You will barely notice, but it will move Grimstone a little bit more in the middle of stone and blackstone. Contrast in the block set will be lowered because it's too high at the moment. The darks are very dark, picks on Monday. Now this is so interesting because Japa just kind of came out with this out of nowhere and then said picks on Monday. So tomorrow we are going to be receiving quite a few screenshots from Japa giving us a sneak peek as to what the brand new Grimstone will actually look like. Now someone called Felix who is also a developer over at Mojang says tint is very slightly towards purple you won't regret it. So that is basically Felix coming out and sticking up for Japa saying you know don't underestimate your own work it looks a bit different and this is just so exciting all around. I know some people might think at first why is this so big but this is just absolutely huge news because this block is a lot more important than you might realize this block will make up the majority of the deep dark along with some of the new caverns we will actually find below negative zero so Actually, this block is very important to the Caves and Cliffs update. I would argue the most important. Now, I kind of had to go at this myself, trying to figure out what this new Grimstone will look like, and I will put my attempt on screen right now. Obviously, I took the information from Japa along with Felix to kind of figure out what the new Grimstone will look like. And as I said, it's somewhere between Blackstone and Stone, and the tin is slightly towards purple so this was my attempt at making the brand new grimstone and be sure you let me know what you think of this down below in the comments personally I do like this I'm a bit biased obviously because I made this myself but if I could choose how grimstone would look this is how I would choose I just like it I think it does not look too harsh or contrasty I think it just is like the perfect mix of everything now this is kind of reminding me of the situation that happens with cobblestone in the past or even gravel because those blocks have been through so many very variations in the past and I know the old cobblestone and gravel textures were not the best looking but personally they're just so nostalgic but yeah that's why I'm glad they are changing Grimstone rather now than later I'd rather them change it now in the snapshot phase then change it a few updates down the line and now I believe this news is hinting at a lot more than you might actually catch on to at first obviously Japa was talking about the new textures coming out on Monday images of the new textures but does this mean that Mojang is still focusing on the deep dark and the caves personally that's what I believe because let's say on Wednesday Maljang wanted to release let's say a snapshot about the archaeology system Japa would not be focusing on this right now so I think this actually gives us a pretty good hint as to what will be in Wednesday's snapshot which I believe will be deep dark related items or just cave related items. We know that right now Maljang are focusing on the caves and the underground before they go above ground to the mountains so it's just pretty interesting and the fact that they are still 
focusing on Grimstone and how it looks makes me think that they are focusing on the Deep Dark more than we could first realise. And maybe could be hinting that we'll get something like the Warden or the procedurally generated Deep Dark in the next snapshot. Maybe even Skulk or the Skulk growth or the Skulk veins we talked about in yesterday's video. So yeah when you get all this news and put it together this announcement from Japa saying there is some news coming tomorrow it's just very interesting and just gives me some deep dark kind of Skulk warden vibes and just gives me an increased feeling that we will get something to do with the Deep Dark on Wednesday. So be sure you let me know what you think about all this down below in the comments. Do you think that this was just an off comment and we will get a completely unrelated snapshot and this is just the textures being dropped in there like they have done in the past or do you think that this is a little hint that they are focusing on the Deep Dark and the caves and we will get something we've been waiting for forever now such as the warden or skulk but yeah if you did enjoy the video be sure to drop it a like and subscribe if you are new around here tomorrow i have a very interesting video coming about some potential updates that are coming in the future that have been teased by Maljang. so if you're hyped for that be sure you subscribe so that you do not miss it you can also check out our discord and twitter everyone there's links to both in the description and yeah i just want to thank you all yet again for the support here on the channel it means so so much and i will continue to create amazing content for you all but thanks so much for watching everyone if you've not already noticed i do kind of these daily questions now over on the community tab like asking what your favorite block is or what your favorite items are and it's just kind of a cool place to go over there and interact so be sure you check that out at the end of this video but yeah as i said just thank you all so so much everyone and i cannot wait for tomorrow one final thing everyone be sure you go down below and comment what your ideal dream minecraft update snapshot would be is your dream snapshot that one day we will get something to do with the ender dragon or a snapshot to do with the desert or a snapshot to do with wolves it could be the most random thing just be sure you let me know down below your dream minecraft update snapshot of course if we get something big or some big hints i will be sure to let you know obviously with a video so stay tuned but thanks so much everyone and goodbye